Welcome to Wisebulb. Today I am going to show you how to integrate Wabox app with Wisebulb. First log in to your Wabox app account. We now need to add your WhatsApp number to Wabox app. Go to the My Phones tab and click on Add New WhatsApp Number. Now follow the instructions given. First open Google Chrome. Next install the Wabox app extension. Once installed, configure the extension with your API token which you can get in the Developers tab. The final step is to open your WhatsApp account on WhatsApp Web. You have now successfully added your number and your number will be displayed in the My Numbers section. Now let's set up a flow on Wisebulb. Log into your account and go to the Create Flow section. Now select your trigger as per your requirement. In this case I will choose Webhooks by Wisebulb. Next choose your action as Wabox app. And click on Create Flow. Next you need to set up the trigger. The trigger in this case is Catch Hook. Next copy the Webhook URL. This URL should be used in your code. Next trigger the URL using the post action. The data will appear in the test event. Next let's set up the action. You can either send a text message or a media file as the action. I will select the text message action for the purpose of this tutorial. Now you need to connect your Wabox app account to Wisebulb. Enter your API key, phone number with country code and account name and add the account. Next set up the action template. Enter the text message that you want to send. Next test the action. Make sure you save the flow. As you can see the number of messages exchanged increases by one which means that the action is working. You can change the name of the flow by clicking on the flow name. Next trigger the URL using post. As you can see the number of tasks executed is 1. In the Wabox app dashboard the number of messages exchanged increases by 1. This shows that the message has been sent. And the flow is working perfectly. Thank you for watching.